good morning from Italy guys we are in Turin today and I am so happy to be here it is my first day in Italy ever today we're gonna be doing 24 hours in Italy eating only Italian food this time obviously I had to do it whilst I was here every single country I go to this is one of the videos I'm doing I actually need to go and get a charger because I fully forgot my European adapter so I can't charge my phone or anything thankfully I didn't use my portable charger at all which is perfect because it means until I can go find an actual charger I have some charge on my phone thankfully because <laughs> that could have been <laughs> I have been told that Italians eat a coffee and a croissant for their breakfast so let's go get some Italian breakfast So guys, I found a little pastry shop. It actually wasn't that difficult. I just started walking towards the shops and then I found it. I was like, okay. it says croissants and coffee outside. I was like, perfect, that's exactly what I want. I've ordered an Americano and a croissant, but I've ordered a chocolate croissant. They had loads of different kinds. So they had like pistachio croissants, chocolate croissants, cream croissants, all different kinds, it's crazy. But yeah, I did order the chocolate one. I'm so excited to try it. It's actually so good, guys. Honestly, pastries are just insane. I feel like this coffee is gonna make me so shaky. I tend to stick to tea because it makes me like a bit jittery, but I'm hoping because we're in Italy, my thought process is it's gonna be better coffee. I'm hoping that it'll be fine. And also I've been drinking a lot of caffeine recently anyway, so I'm sure it'll be fine. Like it's just such a chill vibe. So happy to be here. Like it's beautiful. Look at that. Oh my god. That is insane. Right, I'm gonna finish drinking this and eating this and then we will go do some shopping. Guys, I swear in every single country I go, I, think I don't pay for things by accident. In Spain, obviously, like, if you've watched that video, you'll know I fully, like, hopped the bus by accident. I, I didn't know, okay? And here, I nearly just walked out of that coffee shop without paying. And I didn't even mean to. Like, I felt so bad. And then there was, there was like all the people outside of the shop thought I was like trying to run away without paying. Drama. Oh, yo, yeah, yo. Yeah. I nearly walked away without paying, Jade. But I did. I, I paid in the end. I went back. And it was only three euros. I paid three euros for a croissant and a n really nice coffee. Like, honestly, that coffee was insane, guys. In London, I can guarantee I'd pay about tenner for that. Yeah, very, very cheap. Very, very happy. <laughs> And I've got caffeine in me, I've had a croissant, lovely, and I did pay for it. I thought I'd paid like when I was in the actual place, but I hadn't. Ay ay ay, stressful. Also, look how beautiful this street is. How pretty is that? Look at all these buildings. But I'm heading to H&M now because I'm going to get some tights so that I can wear like a dress and my legs are not going to get too cold. And hopefully in there as well I can find a plug. But that's the plan and then we'll go get some lunch and find some Italian, probably some pizza for lunch, I think. Guys, I've found H&M. There it is. Okay, so I'm just in H&M and I found some jeans. These are, they fit perfectly and they're actually the right length, even though they're the right width around the thing. I don't know why these fit better than the UK H&M, but they are so much better and they are perfect. So I'm gonna buy these and then we go find a plug. Okay guys, I found Media World. Let's go get a plug. I found a adapter and I didn't just buy a charger. Thankfully they have this, which is like a universal adapter so that I can use it literally wherever I go. Instead of getting a charger that only works in Italy, this is perfect because it means everywhere I go now I've got a, an adapter. I just need to remember to actually take it with me places because that was my biggest problem is forgetting my adapter. Okay, so I've just come back to the apartment and I've got changed, I put a dress on, some tights that I just bought and I've got my sunglasses as well and I'm gonna go try and find some lunch now because I'm absolutely famished but it is honestly so warm and so sunny, the sky is blue. Guys, I'm so happy, like it's so cute here as well. Like, oh. but yeah, I'm gonna head and go get some lunch and then from lunch, I'm probably gonna do a stream but let's go find some actual Italian food. I wanna try and find some focaccia or pizza, something like that. So let's go find somewhere to eat.
Okay guys, I am absolutely starving. I have literally just walked past to see this, which is the mall, I believe. I don't know if that's actually how you say it, but I am honestly so hungry. So I'm gonna go find some lunch now. I think what I'm gonna get is this like pizza pocket thing. Trapezino, I think is what it's called. And it's like a pizza pocket. So it's like a bread. I don't, that's the best way I can describe it, is it's, <laughs> it's a pizza pocket. And hopefully it'll be really tasty and when I get there I'm going to start my stream as well and then go for a walk around a little park that I found. So yeah. Okay guys, big problem. I'm putting my sunglasses on as well because it's like super bright. So the place I wanted to go to get the pocket pizzas was absolutely packed. And honestly I'm not surprised, it looked really really good. But yeah, I probably should have booked. But instead I'm gonna go walk towards the park where I'm planning on doing a stream. I'm gonna go to one of these like focaccia pizza restaurants. Uh, not restaurants, like shops, where they just have like pizza you can take away. And there's one on the way to the park, so it's kind of perfect. So that's where I'm heading now. I'm gonna go get some food from there and get my lunch. And then I've booked a table for dinner tonight so that I don't miss out on the food that I want. Guys, I'm not gonna lie, I can't find it anywhere. Bruh. I've literally just walked down the street and I cannot see it. I, just, I don't know if it's closed, but on Google Maps, it was there, but it, it, it wasn't there. Huh? <laughs> like, I couldn't find it. I walked down the whole street. Oh my god, there's pastries. I found pastry shops everywhere now, but I can't find, like, pizza. <laughs> Which is really annoying because I'm hungry as fuck. This is literally my last chance, but I found a sandwich shop. But I've realised everything closes at 3 for lunch. Which is crazy, like they close and then they reopen in the evening. I'm a bit stressed because I am so hungry and I don't want to like miss out on food. And also I'm supposed to be starting my stream at 3 anyway. But I'm going to try and get to this sandwich shop ASAP because I just need a food in my belly. <laughs> got my sandwich and I'm walking to the park now but not too far I think it's literally like a three or four minute walk and then I'm gonna sit eat my sandwich try and find like a bench somewhere start my stream and eat this sandwich it's huge that's what she said and it's all warmed up it's I decided to get the focaccia one with cooked salami sheep's cheese lettuce and I think tuna sauce which I was like I don't know about that <laughs> like tuna sauce and salami is it actually gonna taste like tuna? I don't know. But either way, I was like, it must be nice if they've put it together, so let's give it a go. Otherwise I'd be stood there making decisions all day. So I went for one of the pre preset sandwiches because honestly, like I can't make decisions to save my life. So it was just easier for me to go. I'll just have that one. <laughs> and I got it with focaccia bread because obviously that is Italian. And I've been told it's very, very different to focaccia we get in the UK, so. I'm excited to try it. I will see you when I'm eating my bread. So I've just started stream. I've got my sandwich. Oh, guys, I'm so excited for this. Oh my God, look at this. Oh my God, it's so good. It was like Subway, but like Italian. It wasn't Subway, but like you went in, you choose the bread, you choose the filling. But I was like, I'm the most indecisive person. So I was just like, I'll just get a preset one. just had a nap and I'm about to go out for dinner now. I'm going to go get some pasta at a restaurant called AM and honestly I cannot wait. I'm so hungry but I'm so tired because I've done nearly 24,000 steps today so I need to go quickly go get some dinner and come back and sleep because I have I had such a busy day but I'm so excited to have some dinner and hopefully I'm gonna try and see if they've got tiramisu I would love to have some tiramisu to finish this video off because obviously it's an Italian dessert so let's head out and go get some dinner I've just come to the restaurant and it's called AM and it's honestly so nice in here their dinner menu is based around fish obviously, as you guys know like I will eat anything so <laughs> I'm excited to try stuff this is what we've got to choose from I honestly have no idea what I want to get. Welcome and Grazie. It is a scallop with a salsa la pentanesca. So I've just got an entree, but we've got, look at this, we've got scallops as like an entree. That looks insane. I decided to get a dessert instead of a starter, and then I've got two courses coming, and I decided to get the risotto and tuna. This is my first main course. 
This is risotto with, I believe, scampi. And my dinner is literally looking at me. How good does that look though? Proper Italian risotto. The risotto was honestly incredible. Literally the best risotto I think I've ever eaten in my life. It was insane. But my second course has just arrived and it, it looks really, really good. It's like tuna with sesame seeds all over and I had vegetables on the side and it looks so, so good. Oh my God, guys, it was so good. Like I have had tuna steak that I've cooked for myself before and it was nowhere near that good. It was honestly like so like moist, but I have got a dessert as well. I finally got a tiramisu, which is obviously very Italian. It's actually passion fruit tiramisu and it looks incredible. I'm just finishing editing this video and I fully forgot to end the video so I do apologize for that but honestly it was just so tired that I literally got back and passed out and forgot to end the vlog make sure you like subscribe hit the notifications button so you don't miss when I post and I will see you next time I upload bye guys